Good morning. So, um, welcome to the workout of Sunday. So yesterday I did this workout in the South Park. So we had this period of, uh, of high intensity for a few days and a lot of, um, a lot of strength. So yesterday I just ran to, uh, like ran five kilometers to a park and then I did 40 minutes of the flow and ran back. So I didn't really, I didn't really record it, but for today, it's gonna be the thousand repetitions, which uh, we're gonna do in the structure of 100, 100, 100, and a few of the burpees, but only 20 at a time. After I post this, I'm gonna run five kilometers at the beach and jump to the ocean. So I promised that I would demonstrate it, and, and I'm gonna do that today. The first thing we have is uh, jumping jacks, 100 times, and I do, um, three variations so it's not gonna get boring let's see how this works because i don't know how to have the right angle and stuff anyhow jumping jacks plain very easy this one and then the other the other one i go uh, out and down like this so 20 20 and the last one of them is flying like that so that we do 100 times. The next one is squat and we do squat three variations as well. If you have dumbbells, you can use the dumbbells. If you don't, you can do it without. I will show what I do. So first version, do the ke kettlebell version. I think I have to show it from the side. You go down and you go up till here. So no higher than your shoulders. Keep a straight spine and contract your lower abs. So like this. You do that 20 times. And then I do one without, where you just go as far down as you can. Also 20 times. And then the sumo squat, where you have a wide stand, the cape, kettlebell or weight in the middle. Toes points a bit out and then you bend it down, but always make sure that your knee is out over number three toe um, so you don't get any knee injuries. Same thing, down, up, 20 times. I do that until we reach 100. Okay, let's see. Next one is push up. Push up three variations. And uh, I'm gonna confess, I do some of them on my knees. So I will show. <laughs> Version number one, I really like to use the dumbbells <laughs> because you can go lower. So you put the dumbbells, you go down and up. So you're just gonna, this is gonna be the triceps version, like that. Whoops. And then 20 times we do elevated. Elevated, you can use your bed or whatever. Feet up, straight spine, core in, down up, down, up, 20 times. And then we do the white stand. So more to go to the shoulders, like this. <laughs> up and down, also 20 times, until you reach 100. If 20 times is too much, you can just do 10, 10, 10, um, until you reach 100. The point is just reaching the 100. Okay, we got 100 high knees. I know everybody knows this one, but I'm gonna demonstrate it anyways. High knees, again, always contract your core. Here, you work on the side core as well. So we go like this, 100 times. Um, abs, straight, 100 straight abs. So, three variations. Again, I like the dumbbell thingy. Down, over your head, and up in a straight line like this. Like that. That's exercise number one. Second one, stretch your legs. Have to press your lower back into the mat. Up and down with the legs. 
no touching the ground. And when you feel your lower back start slipping or lifting, you stop. So constantly have your lower back um, onto the mat. That was one, that was two. Last one, full straight. And in, <laughs> contracting in the middle, like that. I hope this don't go too fast. <laughs> okay, next one we have 100 snats and bodybuilder lift. This is one of my favorite. I don't know why, it just feels really good. So you take um, a dumbbell or a kettlebell or water, uh, whatever you have. I'm gonna close this door. Wide leg stance, always contracting your lower, <laughs> lower abs. You go down here and you snatch it up like this. So what you want to do, maybe I can show from the side. What you want to do is keep holding the contraction and then you push your hips forwards like this. I do that 10, 10 and then the bodybuilder lift i i don't know what you call it i call it body lift. so you go down like this up like that mm -hmm. always contract your core keep a straight spine you do that in total a hundred times um, and then just for the fun of it we make the bodybuilder jumps just to keep it going. Bodybuilder jumps gonna look like this. You go three times like this. One, two, three. You jump down. You jump your legs out. Three times, up again. One, two, three, down. One, two, three. So 20 of them. Next we have is uh, roll. roll for for your back because when you do home exercises targeting the the leaf shape is not so easy so we do the roll in this form you go down to a plank position and you lift up here like i usually just do five each side for 50 and then the last 50 you can use your bed or your, um, I, <laughs> I use the window holder, but I'll just show it here. Again, straight spine, lift up and down like that. Until you reach 50. So then you did 100. Okay, we're getting there guys. Next one is my favorite. So everybody knows me knows that I am a big fan of burpees. We're only gonna do 20 and we have again three variations but these 20 is half burpees i'll show you it's almost like having friends and working out together okay half burpees i do it on my fingertips you don't have to you jump down like this and up so fingertips on the mat down like this and up. 20. Then we have a uh, core, but core where we twist, so we target the side of the core. Also a hundred. <laughs> Guys, let me know if this goes too fast for the next time, tell me. I have this trouble with speed and stuff. Okay, so for the core. This one. Variation number one, you lift your legs, you go down here. A little bit like rowing, rowing, swift your legs from side to side. As you go from the side to side, do that 20 times. Then I like to supply it up with a little bit like we did before, only that you do one arm. It's up like this, you go down and up, down. And up. You do that 10, 10. 
what is really important is still always make sure that you keep your lower lower uh, abs contract and hold as good as possible a straight spine so we don't get any uh, back injuries. The last one is really this feeling of um, yeah of rowing. So when you row, your legs have to be still, and you have to keep a straight core. So you take your hand weights like this. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So, next one is biceps and legs. So I think biceps gets super fast, super boring. So I always uh, spice it up a little bit. So you take the biggest hand weight you have, put it in one hand, do the normal core curls, like one, two, three, ten times. And then what I do, I hold it and I go one, two, three, four, ten times. Shift to the other side. Always make sure that your, um, yeah, your car is straight, your arm is straight, your tricep is straight. So you really only contract the um, the biceps. So because many times we use the other muscles to support and make the movement, but when we do that, we don't get the full effect out of it. So I do that one side, the other side, of course. 10 times here, whoa, <laughs> 10 times. It's really good for your angle stability and mobility, um, and of course, the side of your core, right? Okay, almost at the end. 20 burpees, full burpees this time. And for the last, it's just 100 lower back. So the full burpee is gonna look a bit like this. Standing straight. Go down, all the way down in a push-up position, up here, and jump 20 times. And lower back, you can do a bridge lifters or just lower back extensions. So guys, this was the program with uh, showing it <laughs> possibilities of what you can do. I'm gonna grab my stuff and run to the beach. It's gonna be five kilometers bare feet running with one kilometer with shoes because I don't feel that it's good for my ankles to run on the um, on the asphalt today. It is Sunday, right? And then run on the beach, and then it's time for me to finish my book. So let me know if you, some of you guys are in for this thousand repetition challenge and share your home workout in these lockdown times. Have a beautiful, beautiful Sunday. Do it!